What's happening, everybody? It's Jeff Lightsey Jr. here with the Ball Sports Network. Thank you guys for the continued support. Continue to like, share, subscribe, thumbs up button, all that good stuff. Now, we've got some Twitter beef, some Twitter fingers going on in the NBA by former NBA players. They're not even guys that are playing in the NBA right now. Scottie Pippen and Richard Jefferson. So basically, you know, make a long story short, the Bucks are down 0-2 to the Heat. Richard Jefferson goes on Twitter and says, Giannis is more of a Pippen a Scottie Pippen type player than a Michael Jordan type player, and he needs his Michael Jordan. This is exact tweet. It says, Giannis might be a Pippen. There, I said it. He needs his Jordan. Well, Scottie caught wind of this the next day and came back with that fire and said to Richard, he quoted Richard's tweet and said, I'm not Giannis. I don't have back-to-back -back league MVPs. He will have that in a matter of days, in quotation marks, and he's not me. The question is, who were you as a player? <laughs> I love it. I love when NBA players or former NBA players or legends or Hall of Famers or mediocre role player guys get into it over Twitter because it's some excitement. Now, here's the thing. Scotty is right and Richard is right. Both of these guys happen to be right in the same scenario. Giannis is a better player than Scottie Pippen was. Giannis is going to have two MVPs before the year's over. Giannis has the Defensive Player of the Year award. Giannis has been the lead guy on a team that's won 60 games. Giannis is this, Giannis is that. He has all the accolades. But Giannis isn't an alpha dog. Giannis doesn't seem to be able to get a bucket in crunch time when his team needs it. Giannis doesn't look like he can create his own shot and put the team on his back in the fourth quarter like a Michael Jordan. So who does that leave you to be? A Scottie Pippen. <laughs> that means you need to be a number two on a team with a number one in a championship fashion. There's a lot of great Scottie Pippen. I mean, that's the thing. Because Scottie Pippen is one of the best role players in the history of the NBA, as far as the one of the best Robins or number twos, whenever you compare a team, a championship team, or a team that you believe can win a championship, you compare their second best player to a Scottie Pippen, right? That's the role that like Kobe never wanted to be in. Kobe was the second dog when Shaq was there, but Kobe in his mind was never a Scottie Pippen. He was never, he could never be a number two. So that's why when Shaq got shipped off, he proved that he could be that number one alpha dog, that Michael Jordan type guy. The same with LeBron James. Now, there's things on TV. There's people on pundits on TV saying LeBron James was a Scottie Pippen for a long time. It's not true. It's not true. LeBron went to Miami, but D-Wade was the Scottie Pippen. Let's be honest. LeBron was the best player. He averaged the most points. He, he was assists, the triple doubles, all that stuff. They didn't win championships. They weren't going to win championships multiple in Miami without LeBron. Now, D-Wade has proven to be his own Michael Jordan in the 06 finals. But when LeBron came to town, D-Wade had, had pretty much plateaued and was coming down. And that's why LeBron was the Michael Jordan. He was never a Scottie Pippen. Now, I'm not mad at Scottie for coming back at Richard because, hey, you know, if you're going to call out me or uh, Scottie understands that he's the greatest Robin to ever play in the NBA. He understands that. But he don't need guys like Richard Jefferson talking bad about Giannis and, and comparing Giannis to himself. When Scotty knows, I mean, check his resume. He got he, he got a nice uh, one of the fifty greatest players in NBA history on his resume. Like he's got a nice little rap sheet of his own as far as accolades and awards. But you know, it's it, call it fair or not, Richard Jefferson is just trying to do his job as an analyst, and I think he's doing a good job because I do believe Giannis needs another player not named Chris Middleton on his team. So for Giannis to win a championship or even have a chance of sniffing a championship, especially with Brooklyn bringing back Kyrie and Kevin Durant, he's going to need to go join the Heat or go leave for Golden State. My, my choice would be Miami, team up with Jimmy Butler, all those young shooters, all those young guards, and go run, you know, run rampant over the East that way. But, hey, man, it's great to see some, some Twitter action between Richard Jefferson and Scottie Pippen. Who would have thought on this random Thursday that we'd get Twitter beat between Scottie Pippen and Richard Jefferson? You guys let me know who's right in this case. I say both of the guys are right, but I do believe Giannis is more of a Pippen than a Jordan. Once again, my name is Jeff Lightsey Jr. with the Ball Sports Network. Thank you guys for the continued support. Continue to like, share, subscribe button. I'll see you next time.